Hello AHSD students, my name is Elizabeth Oche and I am a senior at John F. Kennedy High School. This week our COVID projects come from Hope School. At Hope, teachers have designed a very extensive curriculum with over 500 lessons to help their students at home. And with that, they've used classroom connections to stay updated and simply chat. And they've also delivered meals every single day since the pandemic has started. If anything hasn't changed, it's that Hope is more than a school. Here at Hope, we are proud of our collective attitude and response as a district and school to meet the needs of students, families, and staff. Let me shine the light on this amazing team here at Hope School. It has been two months, and look at some of the great things that have been done in a short amount of time. We created from scratch an innovative and complete distance learning curriculum designed to keep Hope students engaged in learning, maintain functional skills, and stay connected with the Hope School community in a fun and engaging way. We affectionately call our distance learning curriculum Hope at Home. To date, we have shared four volumes of Hope at Home with families. We released a new volume every two weeks. So far, our teachers have created over 500 lessons. Each volume came with its own instructional material packets, which was printed, packed, and delivered to every student at Hope School, as well as our home hospital students. A protocol was created for all employees in the process to utilize protective equipment through the entire process. Also, State Superintendent Tony Thurman from the California Department of Education asked for special educators to share their innovative ideas on distance learning, and we were able to share this work that we have created with the state. Also during this time, we've stayed connected with our students and families. Teacher at Home, every Monday teachers are checking in with all of their families to assist with the curriculum and answering any questions or concerns. Another way we have stayed connected is with Tiger TV at Home. This is our Friday pre-recorded school announcement that has been modified for while we stay at home. Students love it. We have shared four episodes with our families. And also, working with ASB, we had weekly challenges that we encourage students and staff to participate through the sharing of pictures and videos. We also stay connected with students and families through our classroom connections. Mm -hmm. Every Thursday, teachers have set up a standing Google meeting with their instructional staff and homeroom students to simply hang out virtually it's been a really good time for both staff and students. We will look back on this time and this will be one of the best things we did while school was dismissed. Also, since school has been dismissed, we supported our families. Since the district kitchen has been providing meals, knowing we have several families that have transportation needs, we had a few teachers and instructional assistants immediately jump on this. Every day, Monday through Friday, they have been delivering district breakfast and lunch to 24 families. As of today, they have delivered over 1,700 meals. Again, we will look back on this time and this will be another one of the greatest things we did while school was dismissed. Not that we created an innovative curriculum, but that we took care of our families and made meaningful connections. And finally, we've stayed sharp through professional development and done some reflection on our work with individuals with special needs in the school team. During this time, all Hope School staff virtually met weekly and together went through an online platform training that is specifically focused on working with individuals with disabilities. It has sparked wonderful discussion and reflection from all. The world has changed a lot since we left campus on March 13th, but one thing hasn't. Hope.